couple of lessons that we can learn from Otis. I mean, I talked about what the word obsolete means, and certainly Otis was considered obsolete because this big yellow tractor, which was newer, shinier, bigger, more powerful, came along. But it could not help when push came to shove. Otis could do things that the big yellow tractor could not do. And I don't mean just from strength. He had a love for the calf. He had a relationship with the calf and cared about the calf. And certainly he came to the rescue when the time was right. Um, and he also, even though some people considered him obsolete, had other things that he could do, like calming the cows down so they could milk more and the chickens to give more eggs that the tractor could not do. He had talents, all of his own, that the newer, bigger, brighter, shinier tractor could not do. I like to think that there's sort of a lesson here in that books themselves will never, ever become obsolete. Reading will never, ever become obsolete. There will always be a time and a place to go in, like this beautiful bookstore, Acorn Books, and find books that we love to read, and read them, and share them with our friends.